start off with clean, freshly washed or co-washed hair. This helps the style to last longer than it typically would if not. The next thing you'll want to do is to part your hair into sections. Four small sections are ideal, so I started off by making one of those sections on my right side. The next thing you'll want to do is to get some wrapping lotion, foam, or mousse. I'm going to be using Garnier Fruities mousse today and apply it throughout the entire section. I'm then going to continue to break it down into smaller sections, pinning up the pieces that we do not need to use. Once we have our smaller sections in place, we're going to comb through our hair and begin to twist, twist, twist all the way down just like we did when we were little girls and we saw a cute guy. Don't be surprised if you see your foaming lotion or leave-in conditioner coming through the curl. Um, the more foaming lotion you have, the harder and more hold your curl will have for your end results. Again, taking a section about an inch to an inch and a half wide and twisting all the way down. Cute little curly. You're gonna do this for each section. Each section will have about four to five small curls in it and the back may have more depending on how thick or thin your hair is. For everyone out there with thinner hair like myself, if you have three to four curls per section, don't be surprised. Once you pull them apart, I promise you, you'll have a full and complete look. Now that you guys have the technique, I'll speed it up so that you can get through this video. all done twisting your entire head. This is where many will start the air drying process, but if you're in a hurry, you can use your diffuser. You're going to diffuse small sections at a time, having your blow dryer set on a very cool setting at a high speed. In order to ensure beautiful results, you'll want to make sure your hair is completely dry before taking apart your curls, so the blow drying process is essential for finger curls. So once you're done drying, you can get to the fun part of taking out the curls. Start by taking smaller pieces from your curl and retwisting it with your finger. This helps to maintain the original form of the curl and helps your hair stay bouncy and full. Now that we have one section done, let's speed it up. bouncy finger curls thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like share and subscribe and comment below on more tutorials that you would like to see thanks again until next time the glamazon